All right, what is going on, everybody? Welcome back to the channel, and welcome back to yet another episode prediction video for this week's up-and-coming episode of The Walking Dead. This is Season 8, Episode 1, the season premiere, entitled Mercy. All right, guys, so we have been out without The Walking Dead for about six months now, and it, it, it's, it's about damn time we get back and do it, all right? It truly is, and I'm pretty freaking excited for it, to say the least. Now, Predicting this episode is going to be kind of hard. It's going to it's going to be a little bit difficult because everything that we've seen up until now, there's only been really one sneak peek that we know is coming from this episode directly. All right. Now, obviously, a lot of things that we've seen in promos and sneak peeks or, you know, trailers, whatever you guys want to call it, they're going to be a part of the episode, you know, but we don't know which parts are going to be part of this episode in particular, because usually like the trailers and some of the promos they are, you know, shot like three or four, five, you know, even six episodes in. Of, into the season, right? That's, you know, they, they kind of take snippets from each one and um, make it into a trailer, right? Because what would be the use in, like, a Comic-Con trailer if it was just giving you a trailer on one episode, right? Kind of weird. But either way, we're going to start this off, all right? We're only going to be really able to go over the sneak peek and, you know, talk about some things that are happening in, in the promos and stuff. But other than that, that's all we're going to be real, really able to hit on. But next week is going to be fair game because next week we'll obviously have a promo for episode two. We'll have a sneak peek for episode two, probably two sneak peeks actually for episode two. And I'm pretty excited. So let's go ahead and get into this. Season 8, episode 1, entitled Mercy. The synopsis is as follows. Of course, you guys can follow along in the description below. There will be a link to the AMC.com website, so you guys can read along if you guys want to. Uh, Rick and his group, along with the Kingdom and the Hilltop, have banded together to bring the fight to Negan and the Saviors. That is it. That's what we have. It's a big, long sentence with some commas, and it's just running us down what we're going to see here, and... Essentially, that describes All Out War. Now, if you guys aren't familiar with the comic books, you know, obviously spoilers, but All Out War does take place. That's what it's, it basically is called. Now, I don't know if necessarily they just tried to avoid the All Out War name for the episodes, or maybe it's going to be episode two or three, you know, something like that, something along those lines. I really don't know. I was kind of expecting All Out War to sort of be... Uh, maybe an episode title, like in the name of an actual episode, because we've seen before with like No Way Out, you know, we've had that episode obviously in uh, in The Walking Dead Season 4, and you know, we've actually had those titles, which is pretty cool, because seeing those titles come to live uh, in episode form, you know, the titles of the episodes, is pretty cool, because that's obviously, a you know, the name of a volume of The Walking Dead. Um in All at War, we have All at War Part 1, and we have All at War Part 2. And that, that would obviously be uh, Volume, I believe, 20 and 21. I, I, I think I, I think it's 20 and 21, but could be wrong on that. Um, those are the two volumes of The Walking Dead that are All at War. Because I believe Volume uh, 19 is March to War, and then Volume 20 and 21 is All at War and All at War Part 2. So... We could definitely get All Out War and All Out Part 2, uh, All, All Out War Part 2, rather, in, like, Episode 2 and 3. That definitely could be a, a thing that might happen. And, you know, this episode's probably leading up to the All Out War. Um, now, March to War, we really seen the build-up in Season 7, like, near the end of it and everything like that. Of course, spoilers, you know, shit did go down. Uh, we did see the awesome part where, uh, you know, the Kingdom and the Hilltop did show up, and we seen Shiva save Carl's life. And that was really badass. It was super dope. And, uh, obviously because of that, Carl's still alive, and now they actually have a fighting chance against the Saviors, because all the groups have sort of come together as one, you know? And, um, spoiler, in the comic books, Rick and his group, or his crew, you know, his, his couple of groups, whatever you guys want to call it, uh, they do march on the Saviors co compound, and basically, they, they, they give them the chance to surrender, all right? That's kind of why I'm thinking this episode title is named Mercy, because that's what Mercy means, you know? I take mercy on you, you can sort of just surrender, and just admit that you lost, you know, admit that you have been defeated, and nobody has to die, right? That's what mercy means, and so I'm kind of thinking that's kind of what it means, because we do see um, Daryl, you know, on a motorbike in some of these shots, and we know that sometimes when he is on his motorbike, we know that he does end up leading hordes of walkers. Now, that was a thing in the comic book, and it looks like it's a thing in the TV show because of the trailer, Comic-Con trailer, we do see, like, a horde of walkers beneath a bridge that I believe Tara and Carol were sitting on, and it looks like they're leading the horde of walkers 
uh, towards somewhere. You know, we, we've seen them lead walkers before, right? They have different strategies to lead those walkers to certain places, and it looks like they're sort of doing that again. And my personal opinion, I think they're going to be leading those walkers towards the uh, the Savior's compound, the sanctuary, if you will. And I think, basically, they're going to try to get them to give up, you know, mercy, if you will. And um, when that doesn't happen, you know, they're going to send the walkers in, and they're basically going to pin the Saviors inside of the sanctuary for as much time as they need to, you know what I mean? And um, I'm pretty excited for it, because I think that's going to be really entertaining. Uh, we do see Negan in a couple of sneak peeks and promos and stuff like that, um, sitting down in his chair in the sanctuary, basically looking really angry and slamming his bat down on the table, just looking really, really furious. And all the while, I believe, you know, why would he be in there sitting at his table looking very, very furious and not necessarily looking hopeless, but just looking very angry that something has happened to him? And, you know, why would he be doing that if, for example, everything was clear outside and, you know, he could just go and take vengeance on Rick right now, when in fact, I believe their compound has actually been surrounded during that specific scene. So <clears throat> that's what I'm kind of thinking. <clears throat> excuse me, is going to be happening. Um, I think it's probably going to be happening in this episode. Now, we don't really have any proof to say that it's going to be happening in this episode, but I think that if they just went in with the All Out War storyline right off the bat, uh, it would feel very, very rushed, because again, March to War was in Season 7, we got to think about that, and we got to think about the starting of the All Out War storyline as always been them mar marching on Negan's compound and essentially trapping him in there and, you know, trying to get him to give up, trying to get him to surrender and stuff like that. So I think there's a very good chance that that's going to happen in this episode. Again, we will see uh, what the titles of the next couple of episodes are, uh, obviously this coming week, right? Or episode two, at least, uh, which I'm pretty excited to see because if we find out the titles like All Out War and then, you know, probably All Out War Part 2 the next week or if they're just going to combine it into one big episode, I don't know. Uh, that definitely could be, but I'm excited. I'm excited to see the next title. I mean, I'm excited to see this episode, but I'm excited to see the next title, because if it's all at war, we know shit's going down in the next couple of episodes, which I believe it's going to be kicking off to a very, very quick season, all right? Like, I think it's going to be right out of the gate, just action-packed. Like, that's kind of what they've revealed so far, you know, the, the trailer, the San Diego Comic-Con trailer that was revealed with the, uh, the action packed inside of that trailer it looks very promising because usually that trailer is shot around like the first second third fourth you know fifth episode and that looks pretty insane for only five episodes in what what goes down there and then of course we have old man rick you know coming up afterwards but we're talking about this episode i'm sorry we're getting off track mercy season eight episode one <laughs> so we have a, a sneak peek for this episode and it's actually a really cool sneak peek it's very neat to watch side by side uh, we know that the opening scene for The Walking Dead in total, like season one, uh, was essentially Rick finding out about the zombie apocalypse before he was in the hospital, or I guess it was after he was in the hospital, but it was shot out of sequence, obviously, so it's kind of like a flash forward, and then it just goes to the story, right? Um, so he's kind of, you know, he's, he's walking through a gas station looking for some gas, and he comes across... Uh, a little girl, you know, he crouches underneath the car, sees the little girl's feet, and that is kind of his first walker encounter, or our and first walker encounter in the show. Um, and that's kind of what happens here with Carl, too. Obviously, much later on in the story, season eight instead of season one, uh, Carl is essentially doing the exact same thing. We see very similar shots to what we've seen in the beginning shot to The Walking Dead. You know, we see him walking down a field and... In the walking, uh, in the walking to season one, we see Rick going through like a gas sign that shows the prices of the gas. Instead, Carl's walking through like two wooden pillars, maybe a sign or something. I'm not sure what it was, but he was walking anyway. It's basically shot side by side, like them getting out of the car together, uh, and Carl getting out of the van. Right? It's very, very similar. And there is actually a video that somebody posted of the two videos, like side by side, shot for shot. Uh, with Rick and Carl, like Season 1 Rick and then Season 8 Carl. It's very neat to watch, and I'll leave a link in the description below, but that's essentially what happened here. Uh, Carl's doing the kind of the exact same thing, but it looks like he sees, instead of a walker, he sees somebody alive. Probably looting, not sure what he's going to be doing there. We have no idea who he even comes across, but Carl essentially gets under the car, sees some feet, again, just like Rick, but this time he looks alive, 
And he essentially gets up very, very fast, rushes over with his gun, and says, hey. And that's where the sneak peek ends. So, very interesting to say the least. I will leave the links in the description to the promos and the sneak peeks that I do have. And again, that video that compares uh, Season 1 Rick and Season 8 Carl. It's very neat to watch it. I definitely recommend you guys go ahead and take a look at it. Because it's very, very cool. But, nonetheless, Season 8, Episode 1, Mercy. That was my predictions, guys. We, um... You know, I'm not really sure exactly what's going to be going down here, but in episode one photos here, we actually have Rick and Maggie as well, um, kind of looking at each other, you know, noticing what's going down. Rick kind of looks like she's re, or kind of looks like he's reassuring her rather. Uh, another photo here, we have Rick, Ezekiel, and Maggie on top of the back of a truck, like a trailer type thing. Um, it looks like they're probably speaking to their people, you know. And, um, again, it looks, it looks very good, man. It looks very good. Like I said, the opening sequence, probably not going to be action packed right off the bat, um, unless it's like a flash forward or something, but it's probably going to be them, them getting ready and coming up with a plan and, you know, talking to each other and just realizing that this is all come to this point, right? They're trying to build it. And I, I realized that they built it throughout season seven, but if it just went straight into the fight, you know what I mean? I feel like they've got to make it try to seem like it's going to be freaking epic. And I think that's what they're going to do. So, Season 8, Episode 1, entitled Mercy. Hopefully you guys did enjoy my predictions. If you guys agreed with anything that I said in this video, go ahead and leave a like and comment in the comment section below and tell me what you guys think is going to happen in this episode based on the trailers and the promos and like the one sneak peek that we have. Um, I can't wait, man. This this Sunday, guys. AMC. All right? Uh, the nine o'clock eastern all right it's 10 o'clock my time like atlantic or whatever but either way nine o'clock eastern uh, i'm excited man i I'm, I'm 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 freaking excited there's no other way six months six months man i mean i know i say this like every time we come back to this six months it's it's been a ridiculously long wait and i can't wait for it so season eight episode one in top mercy here's this sunday amc 9 p.m eastern make sure you guys go ahead and tune in my episode review will be up on monday um, which will be the, the th I was going to say the 30th, I'm a, I'm a week ahead here, uh, the 23rd, all right, so the 23rd of October, that's when my episode review of season 8, episode 1, will be up of Mercy, and again, there we should know the title of the next episode as well, so we'll kind of hit on that there, maybe a little bit, and then obviously, predictions Thursday, review Mondays, that's, you know, it, it is what it is, it's always been like that, it will never change, I'll talk to you guys on the next video, man, I'm, I'm, I'm stoked, I'm excited, there's no other way to put it, I'll see you guys then. Take care, everybody. It's been Frost. Bye.